So that dog was plot important. Welcome to the compilation of best mouth farts. I'm your host, Tenshuchu. I, I, I'd like to talk, but I don't want to talk over, uh... There we go. Okay, so, hi, welcome back to Blue Stinger. What were you talking oh. over? The noise from his lightsaber. Oh. oh. It's, so, it's sort of, I don't know, it might be loud for me, it might make it quieter. In the oh, no, no, it's very, very loud. You're just gonna make that one part louder. I have my audio down to as low as I can make it and still hear the video, and it, uh... Oh, I should, that's a good idea. I, I should it, probably... still, it still makes me want to stop talking. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, do you have something to contribute, lightsaber? <laughs> yes. So, welcome to Blue Stinger, uh, featuring Entrance Jew, Joe, Robbie Dude, and Lightsaber. <laughs> the secret fourth commentator. Doesn't talk that much, but when he does, oof. Yes, yeah, the fourth musketeer. <laughs> Hi, guys. Still surviving like cockroaches? Who are you? <gasps> no! Now look what you did. You scared her. Next time I'll answer the line. So I'm stuck in a dark hallway. Yeah, there's not a lot. Oh, there's lighting. This sort of makes you think, actually. Like, when in... Like zombie video games, when you have a character interacting with all these zombies and not getting affected by it, it's actually it's kind of neat to see it actually happen to one character. Well, that happened in Dead Rising. In Dead Rising, it didn't have any effect. He just kind of kept going. Oh no! I I gotta get the bees. <laughs> Where are the bees? I'd like some bees, please. <laughs> you have to collect this much bees to advance the tank. It's good to see you can still swim, I think. Um, I he forgot how to for a moment. Oh, there's big fishmen are here too. I I forgot there was more than one fishman in the entire game. That but the smaller razor fish. I forgot about those too. Thank God there's more fishmen. But I'm actually trying to complete the game um, within the five hours still. And I think I'm making pretty good progress. So after this point, you're going to see me rush through a lot. Speed run, if you will. He's going to hold down the boost button the whole time. <laughs> I'm going to do slide dashes. He's going to oh. break the game. Can you're going to go see some pretty, some pretty uh, sick tricks, if I don't mind my saying so. I don't mind, don't worry. Then I'm going to run backwards the whole time. Then I'm going to donate $50,000 to it. Oh. For cancer. For curing Elliot's disease. <laughs> For alien. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Prevent raptor. Scorpionitis is a serious disease, which is affecting everybody every day. And for as much gold as that guy dropped a day, <laughs> you too can help cure a boy. <laughs> Just one more Italian. Or buy a novelty sized pair of sunglasses. <laughs> wow, that debunked any donating I will ever do. Yeah, fuck, forget that. I can have a room. Wait, 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 there's inflatable hammers. Oh, oh my god. So we had to go into that one room to get a key, but also to open the air ducts so that we could get over here. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, the air ducts were closed. Just, just let me know, is, um,. Is glowing anime wife a thing still? It exists. The concept of glowing anime wife lives on in Elliot. Scorpion Elliot, that is. Elliot's turning into a Pokemon. <laughs> I don't like what they're doing with the new designs. <laughs> First generation Elliot was way better. It was just normal Elliot, but purple. And then he evolved into Elliot with two heads. Then they put stripes on it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Did you know that Elliot's name backwards is Scorpion? Hold on, let me write this down. Oh, he's right. <laughs> so, we're playing Gardening Challenge 2011. 
that one, Steam. <laughs> Plants vs. Zombies Zero. Oh! <laughs> oh! It's okay, it's okay, <laughs> we had life hooks. <laughs> Santa is persistent. Oh yeah, you picked up those life hooks before. And I guess you Good. never really needed them until now. No, before the little bugs that bumped into you didn't do enough damage to hit you anywhere. And your chances of walking off the edges before were kind of slim. Now it seems more of a threat. I forgot that it actually became a thing later. That's the, that's the thing with this game, is that it makes me forget what happens later because it's just so absurd. Is the What's timer font the same font as like Spider-Man 3 and the PS3? Possibly. Because it, it looks that way. Let me just say, I have no clue what you mean by absurd. As the yeah, Santa yeah. Claus is talking to the Scorpion. Elliot, please answer me. Janine, uh, can you hear me? Janine. Merry Christmas, old Santa. What's wrong with Elliot? Well, it's it's a long story. He's infected by the monster cell. Will he survive? It depends. I've got to find the right medicine. If not, I may have to finish him off myself. Oh, I see. My prayers are with you. Assume that once the timer runs out, they wait for the cutscene to end. Mm-hmm. This is just common courtesy. They wait until the timer ends and then it goes from the cutscene into something and then it plays whatever happens when you die. And this Elliot just falls over like he just got hurt a lot. And so we're here to fight Pudding Monster. Oh no. Go Gert Monster returns. Part two. But this chocolate. <laughs> but this time. He's mad. This time, he's chocolate. <laughs> he does not too different from the monster before. He's supposed to be able to drop smaller versions of himself if you wait long enough, but there's no reason to. I'm gonna go ahead and take the time now to make this statement. Um, slime monsters in video games, uh, they are really like a hit or miss for me. Like, there's some really iconic ones, like the Dragon Quest one, which is my absolute favorite. But then you just have Goop. I don't know, I'm not too big on Goop. What? Most people have problems with the Morpha fight, but see, if you just use the Bazooka, then you can avoid... Oh, I get it. That monster was composed of human parts, and as was the one prior, but it was more... less dead people. More like, uh... It was more blue. It was really more blue. This one had more of a fleshy color. <laughs> well, the, the the one here has bones, and the one before had kind of like organs and whatnot going on. Well, wouldn't bones be hard, harder to turn into something like a gooey sort of state? You've obviously never swallowed a bone before. This is true. <laughs> also, speaking of gooey, and speaking of slime monsters, yeah, gooey, feeling it? Kirby Dreamland 3? Oh. Oh, that's funny. Oh. Nah, I don't get it. Oh. oh. I'm just calling back to my, uh, yeah. my statement before, but you know what? I'm just gonna drop it, you know? So now we can mix drinks. Oh, good. And climbing up here gives us access to two little shortcuts. Um, meth the Stairmaster. And it's also a good workout, yeah. My god, he's turning into a monster. <laughs> Look at the way he climbs those stairs. A really buff monster. <laughs> he's ripped. <laughs> 
that gives us access to the hallway we've gone through before, and as does this one, but we need to go this way. The tank is now full. Oh, I couldn't eat another bite. <laughs> So this gives us access to R-305, which, from the text before, is supposed to slow down the transformation of the dinocyte cell. We really don't need it. We, it's entirely possible to do this section without opening the R-305 tank, without flooding this room, without extending our timer. Oh, wow, yeah, you probably wouldn't need that in any situation. So, no, wait, I'm a little confused. Why did that happen? R-305 revert slows down the effects of uh, the dinosaur. Ah. You still you got three appendages, though. You ever hear that joke about the uh, two fish? Two fish in a tank? I don't know where this is going. Yeah, this is sort of... No, 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 hear me out. So there's two fish, and they're both in a tank. One fish looks to the other one and goes, How do I drive this thing? <laughs> Thank you, good night. Yeah. Let's, uh, let's move on to the next one. Nothing more really needs to be said. <laughs> <laughs> I did a little motion with my hands, by the way. Like I, <laughs> I imagine you just had finger guns. <laughs> Cha-cha-cha!